guys, it's your girl Anissa. I'm here to bring you a quick show and tell of some affordable wigs. And I purchased all my wigs from wigtypes.com. So I'll start this whole video with just kind of telling you about my experience with wigtypes.com. I really love the prices that I found on the site and they always have like different little promo deals going on. So I really felt like I got a lot of bang for the buck. The shipping came pretty quick and um, I had no issues getting that information from wigtypes.com to me and my packages came through UPS. It was delivered today is Thursday for me, the 17th of March and I placed my order literally about exactly a week ago and got my products pretty quickly which I was super excited about. Um, also to wigtypes, wigtypes.com, I love the price for all three wigs I got. I paid about $58 and some change. So that's a, like a very easy price point to be able to spend on and get a little variety. So so without further ado, let me go ahead and get started with showing you what I purchased and I hope you enjoy it. And don't forget as always, if you have comments or questions about what I bought, you can always leave a comment down below. So the first thing I'm super excited about because I've always wanted to do like that Kim Kardashian short blonde hair or like how Beyonce had the short long bob, the lob. And I found a wig that really looked really fun to try it. It is called, it is the Free Trust Equal Invisible L Part Wig and the style is Eternity and the color is OF2730613. So they have other available colors. So I've just pulled it out of the bag but it comes in a little package and it has the stock card and all available colors are also on the stock card in case you love her and you want to get her more colors so I'm literally unpackaging this for you all guys like I was so freaking excited to come home from work and I was like I'm gonna record this unpackaging video hashtag YouTube issues <laughs> oh dude the color on this like I've heard, see I've seen a review that complained about this part so where it goes from this lace part that's here and underneath the tracks of how is much more fuller blonde but I don't think I'm gonna mind that to be honest I think I mean guys it's not like a $300 wig and I, I get it you want to make sure like everything's nicely but this top part is so pretty like the coloring oh my lanta so the lanta is pretty as well and this is the part it's just a lace part it's not along the entire hairline and I do usually tweeze it just to make it look more realistic and then I usually put a little concealer on my parts um, and there's so many tutorials I'll link like my favorite ones of how to do it or also too I'm gonna flip this over it has two of these little combs I love it when it has two combs right there like I feel like this ain't going nowhere. Nowhere at all. And it has one comb in the back. I usually always end up moving the part over to the side here. I'll have to like do a real like life try on. Oh, she's already on my side. Already on the right on on the right side. Literally on the right side is where I like my part. I don't know I just think my part looks weird when it's over here like this wig I shifted and I don't like it and the laces there, since there's no lace up front you don't even have to do extra trimming so just for kicks and giggles because we're all friends and family here on my channel I'm just gonna try this on okay guys so I went ahead and spruced this up really quick because I was just wanting to kind of wear it and get used to it because this is so much brighter than what I'm used to I'm usually used to very 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 dark hair and I I don't what are your thoughts on it tell me below like oh my gosh like does it look good <laughs> y'all are YouTube is literally the first person well you all who are watching this are the first people to see me and this brighter hair color since a very long time the last time I was this bright was when I was 16 so um yeah but this is it on this is the back it's the back there The next wig I got was this Alexis wig, but I have it in the color 1B, 
Um, my hair is naturally curly, but I just want it more hair. Like sometimes I just want to have like that extra hair. And this one's by Sensational. Alexis has a stock card that comes with it and it shows it in a color combination. Um, and then on the back, they also show you the other colors that this comes in. Okay, so this is Alexis Unwrapped. She has, she has full lace right here. So your edges are completely laced and you have two options of how to do the part. You can leave it as is with the lace or you can cut it and then blend your own natural hair. It comes with these awesome combs, so two on the side and two right at the part, so you literally have the perfect possibility with this. And then it has one comb at the back and then the adjustable straps to make it tighter. But I have a big head, so it will probably be on the very loosest strap notch possible. Um, the length here is pretty nice, decently long compared to like the top of my head. It'll be past my boobs. So this is going to be for when I want to act real extra. And it doesn't say the length exactly. And I'm, I, I've i been out of a weave game for a minute. So I'm going to have to say this down 22, 20, I think. If y'all know, let me know. <laughs> um, and then this is heat safe up 350 um, to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. But Honestly, I think with this, once it's finger comb, it's going to be awesome. It only, I think it only has a couple loose hairs, really, from when it first came out. I mean, all hair sheds. Like, if your natural hair sheds, of course the wig's going to shed. So, as long as it's not, like, me dropping clumps of hair when I'm walking, I'm okay. And these curls are really beautiful. And this is the color 1B that I have here. I want to do this one a little more natural looking. I feel like if I did a little bit of, like, if I did, like, the color, like, almost like this, it would have been, like, a little too much going on because this is already, like, a lot of hair. Let's be honest. Okay, guys, so I'm down to my very last wig today. I wish I had, like, literally 500 more to show you all, but I don't. And I'm not going to let my collection of wigs get out of control. So, guys, I, yeah. Um, the, this one is equal. This is their Brazilian natural. And don't let them play you. This is synthetic hair. I don't know why they call it Brazilian natural. Who knows? But this is their in, lace deep invisible L part as well. And this is in Danity. And that's the stock card. And I got Danity and a 1B, but this wig, again, also comes in many different colors. Danity has a right part, too. So here's the inside of Danity. They have the two clips at the part here, the full lace on the front. Danity also has this little um, comb on the back to secure it there. and has the same system of the hook um, and elastic string to size her up or down um this is like some nice long sensual waves this is gonna be oh my god y'all this is gonna be so extra so 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 extra but i'm gonna enjoy every minute of it like for real for real and the 1b is super luscious in the color this has a really nice luster i'm gonna just take a leap of faith here and imagine this is why they call it their Brazilian collection because the luster isn't too like plasticky like your girl is going to be whipping hair in this wig like slay slay and slay again like it is going to be I'm going to be so extra and I don't even care because like when you can just switch up a wig and have some versatility and go like you have every right to be extra you better show it off um, and this is the way it looks on the stock card. So the curls are very true to the picture. They're very, very loose. Danity is also curling iron safe up to 400 degrees, y'all. Um, so I'm just stroking through and there's no real major shedding, just a couple of loose fibers. So I can only imagine this is going to shed a bit, but not that much. And Danity, just like her sisters that have joined my family here today of wigs, um, come in a multitude of colors, but I really did go ahead and do 1B because for me it is the most believable and I will probably not be dyeing my edges because I always kind of blend my edges even when there's lace just so because for me it looks like much more convincing.
like hmm maybe or maybe not i don't really care people will say oh you must be wearing a wig yeah and hello it's fabulous but i don't want it to be super obvious and yeah so Danity's density to me is pretty fair. It's not too thick. I think this is going to look, it will look a lot more natural than something that is super, super full. To be completely honest, I think something like this, if you're wanting some more length but don't want it to look too overboard, I think this would be a great option for you. And even the ends are still pretty nice and full. They're not thinned out by any means. Thank you so much guys for joining me for this wig unboxing so I could do a quick show and tell with you um, of these styles that I ventured out and bought. They're all super different which will give me a lot of variety to work with and I'm so excited to show them to you in like upcoming makeup videos. You have no idea. I like love to change my look up and especially when it doesn't cost that much to do it. So if you have questions please drop them down below um, and until next time you as always stay happy, stay blessed, and stay positive and I hope you all have a fabulous week. Bye.